these dark days call for crimson nights. So when the sun sets, the crimson moon rises. Hey, 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 Crimson Knights, good to see you all this evening. Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for being here. Sorry that I had to postpone the stream from last night, and now we're streaming tonight instead. But uh, by the time I was getting into stuff, it was just getting so late last night that I was like, I know, let's just postpone to the next, next day. So here we are. Tonight, we're going to be continuing with Baldur's Gate 3. We finally, at the end of the last stream on Monday at night, made it to Act 2. And so, we're going to be picking up with the very beginning of Act 2 of Baldur's Gate 3. Which has three acts, and I hear that Act 3 is quite long. Act 2 may be a little bit shorter. So, we'll see, but we're going to get into it tonight. I'm very excited to get back into it and be moving forward with Act 2. Before we do that, we've got a couple of things that we're going to get into. One is we have to open up and taste a brand new G Fuel flavor. The other is that we've got to react to some content from Sabi because we didn't do it at the end of the last stream. So welcome, welcome. Latrice was here earlier. Sabi, welcome. How's it going, my friends? Good to see you. Hope everyone's doing well. All right, let's check out our brand new G Fuel flavor first and get that going, huh? going on here all right sabi said i'm breaking bad because of the heavy work and stuff Sabi said, not going to be able to stay long, Crimson. I have to rest soon. No problem, Sabi. All right, I'm going to turn off the music for a second here. All right, so Crimson Knights, we've got a brand new G Fuel flavor that we're going to unbox. Well, it's not really unbox. We're just going to open it up and taste it and give it a taste. Um... It did come with a new G Fuel Collector sticker. So let's take a look at that first. There it is. Nice new sticker for the spring with the rainbows and butterflies and the flowers. Very colorful, attractive G Fuel Collector sticker that came in the box with this flavor. Nice. Whoop. Just completely hit my screen and threw everything off so that's awesome love that for me <laughs> love that for me right. okay but the g fuel flavor that we got uh which was delivered like yesterday delivered yesterday is quirk Quirk. The G Fuel flavor is Quirk. It is a blueberry lemon matcha flavor inspired by My Hero Academia. Now, I've never actually watched My Hero Academia. Um, I've seen some like anime series and things like that, but I don't think I've seen any My Hero. Um, I'm not a huge anime guy personally. I just have some friends that, you know, were at different times. Um, but very popular show and uh 
really for me what i was excited about is the flavor itself blueberry lemon matcha i'm really excited to try g fuel flavor with matcha in it and the blueberry lemon sounds great as well so um first can look at the wrap here there's my hero academia and it says quirk um and it actually does say the flavor there blueberry lemon matcha and then you go around it's got the different you know characters from the series my Hero Academia. Um, it's very kind of green and yellow, bluish, you know, kind of fits the blueberry lemon matcha vibe and other characters in these little shapes. Um, so there it is. I don't know much, like I say, about My Hero Academia, so there's not much more than I can say about it. Besides that, let's open this up, though. I always use a guitar pick to uh, break the seal. Okay. Okay, it's a... Uh very smart it, it's, it definitely smells like matcha i think you get a little of those blueberry and lemon notes in there but it has a sweetness uh sweet smell so it's kind of a sweet matcha smell and it has a matcha green color to the powder so very promising also good sign we've got the little scoop near the top so don't have to go digging too too much awesome okay so as usual, I've got my winter white G Fuel shaker, but instead of water, I put milk in it because I think that the matcha especially is going to go better with milk. And honestly, a lot of times when I think of matcha, I think of um, I think of boba tea, like boba milk tea, a nice matcha boba milk tea. And so I thought it would go good in milk. So we're going to try it in milk instead of water. Have a little bit of thickness to it as well. We'll have to try it in water a separate time, you know. But first time, I thought some milk would be good, all right? So let's see. All right, so here we go, Crimson Knights. We're going to put the matcha, the quirk G Fuel in there. I almost just put the cork lid on the G Fuel shaker, which wouldn't have worked too well. All right, Crimson Knights, shake this up. Okay, so... Basically looks like a pretty light green. I mean, again, it's in it's in milk, so it's a very, you know, it, it was put into a very white liquid, um, which is probably lightening up the color of this, but it's coming across as a light matcha green. So let's try Crimson Knights. Cheers. Mm. Wow. That is really good. 
quirk in milk tastes like a blueberry lemon matcha milkshake. This is so good. I mean, I could just down this whole thing. Um, what's it remind me of? I guess I'm I, I'm not gonna lie. In some ways, the combination so you can you can very clearly taste like blueberry, lemon, and then you know that matcha flavor in there. But the combination of those flavors, in some ways, almost tastes like Captain Crunch. Kind of reminds me a little bit of the Captain Crunch flavor. You know, if you got that cereal and milk, Captain Crunch and milk. But it's good. Yeah, that's really good. We'll have to try it in water to see what it's like in water. But in milk, I give G Fuel's quirk flavor, blueberry lemon matcha flavor, a five out of five moons. This is a excellent flavor. Drink this whole thing. Um, very, very good. So I am very happy with my new G Fuel flavor. Glad that we were able to snag a tub before they were all sold out. All right. Now let's move over to Discord where we're going to view some content that Sabi wanted us to react to. Okay. So I think this is the content Sabi wanted us to react to, right? Um, yeah, I think so. All right. So Darksiders 2 siblings average talk. Ugh, that seems disgusting. They're just having a little conversation. Nice. Alright, let's look at the next one. Greatest mod. Oh, okay. I thought he was talking about himself. Oh my gosh! <laughs> This is not what I was expecting from Sabi. There is a cute little unicorn. My little pony, my little pony. Na, 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 na. Derpy and silver. Oh my gosh. Well, that's absurd. All right, this says Quora the Sith Lord. Let me a sailboat. Why is that? Stopping a boat every 15 minutes to go to gas. Darth Vader. Yeah. AKA Bill. He's known by his friends call him Bill. You know, he's Darth Vader, but his friends call him Bill. It's a pretty nice, uh, nice little skin Ready? there. Not bad. High quality. Ready for this? Roger that. No. I like how he doesn't have the Darth Vader voice. He's like, Roger that. Watch where you point that thing. Everyone locked and loaded. Nice. Awesome, awesome. Thanks for that content to react to, Sabiasachi. My little pony. Anyways. 
thanks again for being here, Sabi. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Thanks for liking the video and subscribing to the channel. Much appreciated, everybody. I didn't forget, Sabi. I didn't forget. All right, so we're going to be playing some Baldur's Gate 3 tonight. Continuing our playthrough, we're like 40 hours into this game. Just made it to Act 2. Let's let's dive in. Mm, this is this is so good. Mm. That's a good flavor. I love it. Yeah, so um, Sabi said, so you, will, you, will you be jumping into Act 2 tonight and finishing Act 1? At the end of last stream, we finished Act 1, and we jumped in the very beginning of Act 2. Um, we didn't do anything. It just literally ended Act 2. I turned off the stream because <laughs> it was so late. Um... But we're getting into Act 2 and actually starting it tonight. So here we go. Here we are. We came up this elevator. Now we'll take a look around. What's this plaque say? We offer our prayers to the Dark Lady. Whose comfort and grace heals all. These boots have seen everything. Look this says. We offer our pain to the Lady of Loss, that she may truly know her faithful. Um, absolutist expedition trunk. Interesting. Let's read Let's this. See what this does. We offer ourselves to the darkness. That blessed Shah may give us her mercy. Seek and you shall find Give me. us her mercy. This the Absolutist Trunk had a couple potion of greater healing and potion of mind reading, and that's about it. Golden Candelabrum. Curiosity must be satisfied. There's nothing in that. All right, Please. let's go up here. Good find. Weary traveler. As you wish. It's a cool statue right there. All right, I do want to talk to the weary traveler, but let's just backtrack a little bit over this way and see what's over here. Seems like pretty much nothing. Let's see what this skeleton has on him. Hey, Maddie, here. How's it going? Maddie said, I think I might have fall fell asleep watching the Twitch streamer. Weather chisel set. Interesting. Okay. What Twitch streamer you're watching? Is it Crimson Moon? I hear he I hear he's great. I hear he's great. My pleasure. <laughs> Who there, wanderer? Elminster Almar. Of course, a moment to indulge an old man. This is like Gandalf, dude. The very same, Gale. And a fair bit miffed he is, too, finding himself forced to expose his best pair of boots to so many miles of country road on your behalf. I love this guy's outfit, though. Um, many miles, you say. Where do you hail from? I think some proper introductions are in order. Meet 
Elminster Ormar. A good friend of mine, but rather more significantly, he's the most famed and respected wizard in the realms. What about me? What about Have Crimson I, Moon? Indeed. Most famed and respected errand boy, more like. This guy is literally Gandalf. I spare neither time nor my own self to find you. She sent me, Gail. You know of whom I speak. But who, why? Who are we talking about here? Out with it, Elminster. Please. Young man, has your sojourn away from Waterdeep washed away your decorum as well as your patience? Nigh a ten day I've gone without honest fare, worthy of the name, drank naught, but what the sky entitled my thirst. Why, some bread, cheese, and a cup of wine would appear unto me a feast. Surely you won't begrudge me a mite of rest and repast before I get out with it. Maddie said it was VT Sino Glossum for about half an hour to an hour before I came on. What, what were they streaming, Maddie? But welcome nonetheless, and hope everyone's doing well again. Thanks for your understanding me uh, postponing yesterday's stream to today. It actually works out nicely because we'll be able to have a longer stream today than we would have yesterday anyways. So this is working out very nicely. Plants versus Zombies 2. Okay, all right. Yes, Gail, where is your decorum? Oh, for the love of... Uh, well, this way then? Hmm. To your camp. Oh, don't dawdle now, lad. You're the one who's in such a frightful hurry. Oh, nigh on 13 centuries old and he still thinks with his stomach. We'd best follow and see if he's more disposed to speak plainly once it's stopped its grumbling. Well, I suppose I'm as curious as you are to hear what he has to say. Wise choice. Better to indulge your curiosity than Elminster's appetite. Mm, yes, what a delightful wedge of old Elthurium that was. Doesn't do to parlay on an empty stomach, you know. Makes one's words frivolous when they should be grave. Plenty to I love chest. this guy. After all, a good deal to stew over, if you will. Words ladled with import should be savored so as to better absorb their meaning wouldn't you agree alminster uh, right um you see i um i hope uh, this guy joins our party say, gail my boy i've come to address a most pressing matter i'll speak as plainly as i can Forswearing the accustomed frills that decorate my speech. I'm here on behalf of Mistra. Mistra. The message and the charge I bring you are hers. Sabi said that wizard looks like he's from Hogwarts. He kind of looks Hogwartsy, but he kind of looks Lord of the Ringsy to me. Maddie said, really, the only thing that me that means in my head is I'm in another community. But yeah, hopefully I can remember that strategy for that one level because the other streamers watching went off. Um, the message in charge I bring you are hers. What message in charge would that be? The long-awaited question. Now, if you please, Elminster, for the too long-awaited answer. You know where you went wrong, Gail. No, we needn't dwell on that here and now. But even so, you're to be given a chance of redemption. Mistra would consider forgiveness. She would consider what she considers to be forgiveness. Mistra is aware of the misadventures that have befallen you both. She knows of your strife with the Absolute. 
that most insidious of evils. I wonder what the story of the Absolute is going to end up unfolding to be. If even the gods know, why are we facing these threats alone? They choose the instruments of their will with great precision. Sometimes the single drops we think we are do not realize what waves we are building up to be. Do not discount yourself, and by the same token, do not discount your enemy. You must know that the Absolute is more dangerous than you can possibly conceive. It threatens all who live, even those who are undying. It threatens the gods, the weave, the very fabric of the universe itself. That is why I have come here to charge you, Gale, with its destruction. It is Mistress' belief that only you can. Only Gale can defeat? Gale alone? How so? The old. Precisely. Mistra has granted me the power to stop the clock, as it were, on the orb's rush to overpower you. Instead, you will be able to unleash its lethal combustion at will. Interesting. Dream this visitor. Could be hell or hindrance. We shall have to see. You must find the heart of the absolute. Whatever that may be. And use yourself as the uh, catalyst that will burn it from this world. <laughs> we'll be rid of both the Absolute and Gale in one fell swoop. Win-win. Say what you will, but you can't force Gale to go through with this. No, indeed. But I think she trusts me, too. It brings me no pleasure saying this, my friend. But such is Mistra's will. Yours must be the sacrifice that will undo the Absolute. And for your sacrifice, you will be redeemed. Such is Mistress' promise. With that, I've said my sorry piece. And need only bestow unto thee the charm I was bid. My Nahastra Mistra Italian Thras Annas Nice. It is done. Both charge and charm have been committed into your care. So maybe Gale will not to have you, to keep eating our magical care items? To you himself. I count on you to shepherd him well on this strangest of journeys. On my honor, it shall be done. On my honor? I'm not sure yet I can say the same. Like moons make swell and wane the nescient seas, so too the skies strewn gods ordain the tidal fates of mortal days. And yet, a notion born in lonely hours Come, ebb, come, flow, come, all that is beyond the breadth of our dominion. Be a moon unto yourself, even the waves of fate. I'm always a moon unto myself. Get it? Get it, Crimson Knights? Farewell, my friend. Farewell, Elminster. I'm glad she chose you. Repairing the weave. We stabilized his netherese orb. Alright. I have a lot on my mind and, well, 
An audience with Elminster is never less than memorable. I'd have hoped to introduce you to him in less dire circumstances. But those are hard to come by these days. Um... I'd always imagined Elminster to be more imposing. An old man with a craving for cheese, hardly the great wizard of legend. A wizard doesn't reach Elminster's age without enjoying their home comforts. Those who seek danger over cheese don't tend to live as long. For Mistra to have sent him, the severity of her bidding could not be clearer or weigh more heavily on me. Time seems so infinite when you're young. A month is an age. A year is a lifetime. It is a strange feeling to realize how little of it one might have left. You're seriously considering doing what Elminster said? Of course. We offer the clearest solution to our problem. All I have to do is find the right place and time, close my eyes, and let go. Then the slate will be clean. Wrongs will be righted, the absolute will be gone, and I along with it. I don't understand. Can't Mistra just destroy the Absolute or Elminster himself? I've no doubt she has the power to do so, but as for the permission, Ao would not look kindly on her meddling in mortal affairs. Divine intervention has a tendency to make things worse, not better. As for Elminster, he saved the realms more times than legend can recount. But to take on a god is no easy feat, even for him. My orb is the best chance we have. And only I can wield it. There's surely another way. If there was, I'm sure the goddess of magic and the greatest wizard who ever lived would have identified it. But alas, only one solution is offered. That remains ahead of us for now. The heart of the Absolute must be discovered before I can stop its beating. I'll make sure we find it, Gail. I promise. Hmm. Then I suppose there is nothing more to be done but find the heart of the Absolute and stop its beating. That's what I just said! All right. Let's see here. Um, keep forgetting about Will. I like the party we have right now, though. I like it. Oh, that's funny. There's Cersei flowers in the inventory. In this chest, so when I go over to it, it uh, makes me lose my abilities. So it's kind of funny. Foil mass, might as well put these like up here or something. Wanna dance? No rest for the wicked, I see. Don't burn yourself. All right. Let's leave camp. Maddie said, so Monday was tiring me and co-worker had to train, was tiring. Me and my co-worker had to train six to seven new employees. I did volunteer 
do it, so I can't complain much, though. Gotta get all the newbies up to speed, huh? Still alive, so that's progress. Alright, it seems like this Never is the only way in or out that I see. Adept of the Absolute here is dead. I guess he wasn't that adept. No traps, please. Scroll of Banishment, Witch Bolt, and Orders. Let's read this. I've been given the crucial task to clear the entrance to Grim Forge for future expeditions. True soul near will follow once the entrance is cleared. As I make my way to the entrance, I can't help but feel excitement. What might we find here that Ketherick created so long ago, now sealed by the curse? Grim Forge could hold untold treasures for the Absolute's uses. I will continue to explore and document my findings. The entrance is currently blocked by vines and rubble, quite cursed. Explosives ought to do the job, though I'm not as experienced in such matters as I'd wish to be. I set up the explosives with care, though I admit I'm almost afraid to detonate them. There's no telling what power these cursed vines hold, what might lie beyond, or whether I've set things up correctly. Absolute protect me. He either blew himself up or he got killed by that other wizard. I think those are the two options. Alright, to the Shadow Curse Lands. Here we go, Crimson Knights. I won't have to worry about the sun, at least. Ruined I've battlefield. Never seen darkness like this before. It's unsettling. Only way to moonrise, unfortunately. can't remember. I have... Okay, I have Gust of Wind, so let's do this. That did nothing. Okay. That was Gust of Wind. Alright, now let's try something else. Um, lights. desire this is the orb blast now okay what now Um, okay, I don't know if we really have what I would want here, but we can try light, I guess. Moving ahead. Okay, I guess walking through that actually did nothing. Okay. Never mind. I was all worried about walking through that. Didn't even matter. Sabi said, okay, Crimson, I gotta go. Take care. Take good rest these two days. We're heavy hours of duty at my day shift because eight to 10 hours under the hot temperatures are making it even harder. 93 degrees Fahrenheit around 2 p.m. Yeah, Sabi, you've been working hard, man. So get some good rest. Sleep well. Um, I may stream tomorrow as well. So, you know, perhaps we'll see it tomorrow. Shadow Root Sack. I'll take that. Vitriol of Shadow Root Sack recipe unlocked. Elminster's not around, so it might as well. Oh, this isn't even locked. Never mind. Wood bark, mud mephit wing, hill giant finger. Sleep well, Sabi. Have a good one, man. Thanks for hanging out tonight. Thank you, everybody, for liking the video and being followed, subscribed, joined on the channel. Appreciate you all. Let's 
silver goblet. Let's get going. are watching me. Glass distillation set. Okay. Bottled solvent. Bottled blooms. Dead druid's journal. Whoops. Dang it. Where is it? Dead Druid's Journal. All right, let's, let's read this. A handwritten journal abandoned for some 50 years. It details a Druid's attempt to learn more about the Shadow Curse. The entries grow shorter and more sporadic as time passes. Made good progress through the mountains. Seeing the curse for the first time filled me with an awe and fear that was difficult to describe. No writing could have prepared me, nor any artist's rendition. As grave as the Archdruid Halson's warnings were, they were still lacking compared to the reality. I shall make camp soon and press on in the morning, though in truth such terms have little meaning in this place. A dreadful night. The campfire needed thrice the wood that would normally be needed in order to keep it burning. Terrible sounds came to my ears from beyond the firelight. Rest has not restored me. If anything, I feel weaker, but I must persevere. I must trust in the Sylvanus. I must venture deeper. Creatures from the darkness, foul things. One grazed me, only my torch saved me. Deep darkness, flames are instantly doused. The wound stings, flesh is turning black with corruption. The shadows are growing stronger, they're spreading. I need a return to light. The wood will not burn. I can barely see the page. I'm surrounded. I truly hope this blight isn't spreading. So really, we just have to go this way, pretty much. Let's head across the bridge, Crimson Knights. Thank you, Sabi. Appreciate that, man. Again, sleep well, dude. Um, we'll be playing, you know, streaming some more tomorrow night, Friday night. So we'll see you then, dude. Light in west, moonrise towers southwest. Southwest, okay. We're trying to get to moonrise towers, Crimson Knights. The animal never had a chance. Curse consumes everything it touches. So it's a cursed boar. It's another shadow root sack. Let's go over this way. I bet that'll fit in my pack. I bet that sack will fit in my pack. Black oleander. Recipe unlocked vitriol of oleander. What are we looking at here? Harper Lissandra. Let's just do a quick s oh, well. stay together. Keep to the light. Um, 
I'm a sorcerer, so kindly lower your weapons or things might get ugly. Very ugly. Now let's do it. So you can fry us alive? I don't think so. Come into the light, hands high. Look at me just strutting up to these guys. Jonas, look out! What? What is it? Oh, shoot! Jonas. I just got dragged off Jonas. by what? I'm here! Where are you? Jonas? Can you see our torches? I can't see anything! Some, something's wrong. Follow my voice. Come back to the light! Who's there? Meg? Is that... That didn't sound good. Quickly transform Crimson Knights. Jeez. Maddie said, if I can beat this level, that means it would have took me two months, which I'm completely okay with. No, I actually never mind. I just spent all my money again and had the wrong setup. <laughs> Dang, Maddie. Hey again, Latrice, how's it going? Did you change your profile picture again? Hmm. Move. I'll take care of this. Don't let get hold of you. Harpers, now! Alright, here we go, Crimson Knights. Strength drain on Gale. Necrotic claws on me. Okay, that hurt. Jeez, man, I'm almost dead already. Now I am dead. Haven't even gotten a turn yet. Okay, so Asterion. So how can I defeat these guys? This will do nicely. <laughs> Shit. Shit. <laughs> Make every strike. Dang. These guys are super strong, man. And how do I see them? What can we do here? What can we do? Let's do a level three. Well, okay, let's let's actually examine this. Resistance to slashing, piercing, bludgeoning, acid, thunder, necrotic immunity, fire resistance, lightning resistance, cold resistance, poison immunity, radiant vulnerabilities. Wait. Radiant damage against this entity is doubled. Okay, so that's what I need to hit it with is radiant. 
Which I guess makes sense now that we're saying it. Um... Maddie said Clemson just beat number two Arizona. Are there there March Madness games tonight? Force damage. I don't know. I don't have many options. Let's just. Let's see what we can do here. Good damage. Awesome. I did some good damage too. Excellent. Dang. Like, how do you uncover where these guys are? That's the question. Killed me again. Wonder how you how you cure him. Shadow cursed undead. Protect an ally against the attacks and powers of aberrations, celestials, elementals, fae, fiends, and undead. Hmm. this guy like how can I see him that's my question all right let's see what else can we do here um, that's flight shatter oh, now let's just try to kill this guy I guess Got seven health left. Yo, Rashad, how's it going, man? Good to see you. Latrice said, I got second place in Fortnite squads solo. Said, BRB, me and Jeremiah are playing squads as a duo. That's impressive, Latrice. Way to go. Let's cut with fire, baby. Gale and he like comes in swipes and then runs away. I don't know how to uncover him man Like how do you Shadow blend they keep doing the shadow blend thing. I don't know how to see where they are They finally killed Harper Jonas Oh, 
hardly a good time. I don't, yeah, I, I, I don't know what to do. Somehow she seemed to uncover him. Shadow Curse. The Shadow Curse is a powerful threat that lurks and devours in the darkness. Surround yourself with light to avoid its most lethal effects. Died again, dude. Who shot said, What up? Grinding out some work, trying to finish before 12 and sleep on time. Uh, yeah, I've been working some long days, nights, weekends, all that kind of stuff. So I'm just trying to chill tonight, have a good time, play some games. see what we could do with this dude um where's like some radiant or any kind of radiant damage i can do is a question it's like not really so let's just go ahead and do this and try to take this guy out because super annoying Maddie said, two months going and finally did it. Congratulations, Maddie. We always knew you could. No surrender. All right, we got rid of Shadow Curse. Unleash me. Step to it. There's basically one and a half more of these things out there. All right, let's finish this. Let's just get a ranged attack on this shadow. Solid six damage. We'll take it. Torment. All right, that thing's dead. So now it's just this last one over there. Damage it did. Ready for another round. Incoming. 
Oh, it missed. We're trying again. We're trying again. There we go. We did it, Crimson Knights. All right, so now let's heal up here. Whoops, whoops. So we'll do this. Lovely little pick me up. Let's go pick this up. Simple enough. We see an older woman on her knees scrubbing the floor of an inn. The patrons made a mess of things again the night before. Oh, shadow visage. All right. What path lies before me? This guy gonna die. All right, Harper Caro didn't make it so much. Wait, what? What happened? Are we fighting these guys? No, I don't want to fight them. What? Oh, uh, but I, I also didn't save? The last time I saved was a long time ago, dude. Oh, but he's shadow cursed. I don't know if there's a way to, like... Cure him? Like, can I cure him of a curse? I just don't know that I have a way to cure people of curses with these characters that I have. Maddie said, I probably wasted over 200 to 400,000 coins during that two month period. I don't, I don't know like how much that is, you know, in terms of like the effort it takes to get all that, but it sounds like a whole, whole, whole lot, Maddie. <laughs> So how, how can we, like, cure this person of being cursed? Shadow cursed undead. Maybe I just need to lure him over here. On my way. Creator, destroyer, in striking distance. They're killing their friend. On the way. Welcome back, Latrice. How'd the game go? Put him up. Over there. Bad, they have to kill their friend, man. Uh, here goes nothing. What fools these mortals be. Uh, well done. They killed him. Now we've got to move. I know a safe Yikes. Place. Give me your map. Like there's no safe place. Keep your torch high. If you step into the shadows, you'll be felled in a heartbeat. You mean somewhere the shadows can't penetrate? That's right. Protected by magic. Only spot in the region that's not been swallowed up by this damn curse. Light will save you here on the outskirts, but a few paces deeper you're screwed. If you want to catch your breath, the inn's the only place to do it. 
Hope to see you there. Harpers, move out. All right. Well, I didn't kill your friend. You did. Just remember that, please. Again, welcome back, Latrice. She said, not so good. We played Flora's Lava and he didn't even tell me. Whoever made Flora's Lava, lava made it so poorly. Regular Battle Royale is better. Maddie said 350,000 coins is $100, so probably right around $110 in coins. I grinded it up just to waste it on one level. Oh my gosh. He had dreams of boarding a ship in Baldur's Gate and seeing the world. But then the darkness came. In her former life, this girl played in the nearby woods. She was always the best at climbing trees. Maddie said I was in Baltimore earlier for the opening day. Well, hopefully you didn't need to go across that bridge. I'll be down in Baltimore for Easter uh, with my family. That whole bridge thing is crazy. It's also crazy to me how many conspiracy theories there are about it, you know? The image of an orange-haired cat asleep before a fireplace comes to you. What came of it? What came of it? Here is poor Harper Jonas. And here's Harper Caro. Why are we in turn-based mode? You sense a young woman gazing at moonrise towers in awe. Perhaps one day she will get to gaze out from atop it, she hopes. All right, I guess I am encumbered, so we need to move some stuff over here. Good enough. I don't think I looked at this one either. You see a man stalking slowly through the woods, bow half drawn. If he bags a deer, the whole family will be kept fed all winter. What's the story? Oh wait, in turn-based mode. Don't be shy. Night Orchid. There we go. Solution of Night Orchid recipe unlocked. Alright, I think I pretty much have to go this way. What do we have here? Bottle, bottle, bottle rack. Potion of healing, skeleton with a little bit of gold. Charmed, I'm sure. Silk gland and a hyena ear and some gold. Dogpool, how's it going, man? Good to see you. Oh, yeah, let's save. <laughs> let's save. Rusty dagger. There's some rope. Could be useful. All right, let's look at our map now. 
looks like way out here. Seek protection from the shadow curse at the last light in. And then down here it says infiltrate Moonrise Towers. So we got a, we got a long way to go to get to Moonrise Towers. Fourth way. Here's a tombstone. Point. Ellie May, my light, my hope, my joy. We dig it up. We dig it up. Oh, there's nothing this in it though. Has been disturbed. It must have been an animal. Whatever lurks in this darkness. Must have been something. All right, a bunch of rotten stuff. I don't think there's any point of like rotten food, so I'm just not gonna bother. The milk can. Dig up the dirt mound. All right, we got gold and some jade. Now hold up, I did not realize that there were March Madness games happening tonight. Let me look at this. So Clemson beat Arizona. Let me, how do I look at my bracket here? Here we go. Show me my whole bracket. UConn destroyed San Diego State to get into the Elite Eight. Clemson beat Arizona. So I got that wrong. Someone else playing right now? No. What's today? The, today's the 28th. So... There are other games that are going to happen tonight. Alright, but still doing well. UConn easily advanced. So let me look at my groups. I'm still in first place in both of my groups. Not bad. Maddie said, next up, next game is Alabama versus North Carolina. That's an unfortunate matchup for me because I did not predict either of those teams to get this far. So I'm not going to get any points from any of that, unfortunately. Maddie, who do you who who did you predict is going to win it all? Who do you think is going to win it all, Maddie? this can I go up this oh you can climb up this okay Harper journal all right let's read this we're running around trying to find the borders of that blight the ruins east of Last Light proved to be highly dangerous with deep, biting shadows. Another suspicious one is that house on the hillock a little farther on. It seems dark and empty, but voices come from there. One of the others swears to me that he heard a child's laughter and saw Gith Yankee warriors approach the house from a distance. Surely his imagination must be getting the better of him out there. The Gith Yankee. Another night orchid. Scroll of protection from energy. All right, we're just kind of exploring right now, Crimson Knights. Dogpool said, hey, rice bowl. going on here where lies your guilt 
He who was. <sighs> Waiting mode. Uh, what's going on here? Not many people out here in the darkness. I am not people. Though many would question how wise it is I to am approach not a stranger people. in the dark. Be on your way. Cock! The White Raven. A fair point. Perhaps this one could assist us. Maybe you could assist the me. lie silent. The Raven asks, will you be their voice? Depends who murdered this woman. She is not the victim. Nay, she is the perpetrator. This woman tended a bar where she took her patrons, her friends, into her confidence. Promised their secrets were safe with her. Yet she turned their words into knives and stabbed them in the back. They died because of her. And to this day, her victims lie unavenged. She's dead. How much more can she pay? I doubt you're here out of the goodness of your heart. I have no heart. I seek a record of this one's crimes, written in her own hand. Through it, I can summon her spirit. And force her to face trial for wow. her crimes. Wow, that's kind of intense. That's some powerful magic. How do you do it? Can you show me? Such spells are ancient secrets and closely guarded. But I could be convinced to share them with an ally. Your soul sparks with justice. With fortitude. This is your chance to bring a murderer to justice. To avenge her victims. Will you take it? Yeah, sure, let's do it. I will. What must I do? I thank you. As to those who died by her words. I wonder if this Go guy will be a new distillery. ally of ours. Join our the party. she calls the waning moon. Find the ledger and bring it to me. All right. Bunch of pot lids around here, huh? Really not much more up here besides that. Let's go. Let's go. My, my. A little bit of gold in that pouch. Let's go over this way. Not a problem. Light the way with the brazier. Yes. yes. I like that we have a spell to just like unlock these wooden chests. Makes it so much easier than having a roll for lock picking. Now, is it this. Can I, like, jump over there somehow? It's unclear. But what is unclear shall become clear. Can I jump up here? It's like maybe I can jump here. And then can I jump up here? Uh, okay, so we did it. Perfect. Signpost. Night and shadow have claimed this place. Turn back. Nah, don't think I will. Don't think I'm gonna turn back though. Child's diary. Dear diary, well, it's another horrible day. Dad promised me if I didn't like it in Wraithwind, we could leave, but here we are. Told him about a hundred times or more I want to go back to Elturel, but he said he promised his boss to stay until some project was done. Well, who cares about a boss? I want to go. He's ruining my life and he doesn't even care. His boss is a man named Kittrick, and my dad said we're allowed to be in this town as long as we don't let on that we're not a Shar family. 
I just don't say much at school or with the other kids. I don't know what it really means to be a Char family or why we're not one. I don't care either. I just want to go back to El Terrell. I'm gonna go ahead and say she didn't make it. Based on all the skeletons hanging around. I'm gonna go ahead and say she didn't make it. Now, is this another place I can get to or what? I don't think I can get over there. Yeah. Alright, so we kind of explored over here and that's that. I think we... I think that's it. So now we'll just jump back over. From whence we came. read this signpost. We're out on the ruined battlefield still. North, last light in. South, Risen Road. West, Rythwin Town. Rythwin Town. Shadow Curse Needle Blight. All right. God. Shadow Curse Needle Blight are enemies. All right, we might be in trouble. Gale's basically already dead. Sheesh, why are these guys so strong, dude? All right, let's examine these guys. Resistant to necrotic, but otherwise, I don't know, maybe if we light them on fire or something? It's a nice little 14 damage. Can I... These are plants. All right, so I can't suck their blood either, unfortunately. Gail's dead. I cannot take much more. Sorry, Gail, you're you're dead. Okay. Just calm down about all that. Wait, did that hurt me? Sheesh. Boom. Shadow cursed vine blight. Wait, she's attacking not with her actual weapon. Oh, what the heck was that? This is not good. This is really not good. It missed? We might lose here. Oh, 
These things are really freaking strong, man. All right, let's switch to this. Oh, she's immobile. Shoot. Hmm. All up to Carlac now. It's not looking good. I think I'm gonna. I think I lose. Like this is ridiculous. Arrow of fire. So what do we got? There's there's two of these things. Where's the other one? Oh, he's right there. Shoot. I didn't I forgot about him. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna live. I think it's over. Ooh, unless, unless they miss! Unless they miss! Him, then he blew up and killed me. Dang it. Oh. That was dumb. I thought, I was like, oh, maybe I'm going to do it. Maddie said, uh, fun fact, NCAA men's basketball champions. It says Oregon was the first one back in 1939. I might have to back check that, though. I'm not sure if that's true. I don't know about that. Yeah, I don't know. The first, like, March Madness tournament? I don't know. I feel like I'd be a little bit surprised if this March Madness uh, tournament, as it's conceived, has is that old. I feel like it's got to be newer than that. Um, okay, so I died. So uh, let me go grab a adult beverage, and we'll continue with the stream. I'll be right back. Maddie said 1939 was the first ever March Madness. Oregon came out on top, so it's true. All right. I'll believe you, Maddie. I don't know. So I'll believe you. Uh, okay. So unfortunately, our last save file was a while ago.
this is a bummer because once again, you know, I didn't I didn't save often enough and now we're paying for it. Let's quick save here. And then here's what we're going to do, Crimson Knights. We are going to... Let's get a surprise attack in on these guys. I don't know why it's saying disadvantage. Um... Oh, I could go for a good meal. We're a long way from Waterdeep. See, then he blew up. Oh, they both blew up. All right, so that really hurt. Okay, so this guy is coming over here. Okay, so they're all on this, so here's what I want to do. I want to knock these guys off. Okay, 
that didn't really do what I want. Let's see if he can knock these guys off. So. These boots have seen everything. I want to not knock her off if I can at all help it. Okay. I blew myself up. That's unfortunate. Yo, DNL, how's it going? Thank you for being here, DNL. Appreciate you. So I'm confused. Is this thing getting hurt by that? No. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Crimson Moon fully died. Come on now. Sheesh. Oh, that was a big critical hit. Awesome. sack wasn't the wasn't the prettiest wasn't the prettiest by any chance by any by any means I mean but we got the job done what if I just left my main character dead just leave him dead Thanks for the encouragement. Appreciate that, DNL. Happy Easter weekend to you as well. All right, we need to we need to <laughs> we need to camp. Okay. Let's go to camp. I guess we need to revive myself. I need to resurrect my main character. Where's Withers? Where's good old Withers? Up yep, here, something. Here he is. Uh huh. Yeah, my main character hey. died again. Blew himself up trying to be a hero. You know how it is. Fate spins along as it should. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead. Then thou must return with the proper payment. This is the price of balance. We've got to pay well 200 counted. coin for this. I recommend keeping my distance 
for a moment. By doom and dusk, I strike thy name from the archives. Rise. Hmm. I picked Iowa State to beat Illinois. Iowa State's currently losing 11 to 2. Uh oh. My bracket might fall apart here in this round, Crimson Knights. We'll see. All right, so I'm back now. Let's do a long rest. Breathe deep. Let's talk with Carlax, see what she's got to say for herself. Hey, soldier, I... <sighs> well, I'm not feeling so good. <sighs> My engine. It's getting worse. <sighs> Feels like it's going to burst out of my chest. That seems not good. We need to catch up with that mechanic and pray he's extremely good. Don't worry, we'll find him. I'm sure we will. <clears throat> but in case we don't, a bit of advice. You leave your left flank wide open. If I'm ever not around to cover it, you may find yourself on the wrong side of a goblin spear one of these days. Hey, Moon 13, are you winning? We're all winning together. How's it going? Good to see you. Oh, looks like we can talk I to Asterian as well. Everyone's got everyone's got something to say right now. This dark land must be filled with the broken, the beaten, the desperate. The perfect praying ground for a devil who offers a way out for those who sign on the dotted line. I hope we end up seeing our friend Raphael down here somewhere. Why do you want to see him? Help me find him, and you'll find out. When I was taken to his house I was caught off guard but now now I know what to ask for sure I want to see how this plays out perfect I knew you would understand all right This place, these shadows, I don't seem to be affected. Not as badly, anyway. Perhaps I shouldn't put it to the test, but compared to everyone else, I feel fine. Better than fine. Do you know what this means? I must be blessed. Lady Shah is protecting me where others are left to face her wrath. She loves me. She must do. But what about me? You're resourceful. You'll find a way. <laughs> Don't give me that look. It's a good thing that I'm resistant to the shadows. This way I can help you. So she's Lady resistant Shah to the shadows, huh? Like this for no reason. There must be something she wants of me. The Shadowfell, her domain, has power here. Whatever the Dark Lady needs of me, I'll wager the answer lies wherever her power is strongest. I need to find that place. See what awaits me. Okay, so that tells me that we should add her to our party, right? Um, let's see. Who should we get rid of? Let's get Gale out of our party, I guess. So let's get Gale out of our party. I've never seen such a concentration of shadow magic. We must forge on, but carefully. It will corrupt any who lack the power to control it. I recognize shadow magic when I see it. You needn't explain this to me. Oh, <laughs> of course. 
Oh, sometimes I forget who I'm traveling <laughs> He's with. He's like, of course, of course. Takes some getting used to walking amongst peers again. Darn right. I yes, the shadow I am your peer. No ordinary spellcaster. And certainly had no fear of Mistress' punishment for doing so. Moon Thirteen said, "The brackets. Am I winning? Uh, I don't know. I don't think only only two people put brackets in the Crimson Knights group. That was Angel and Cora." And uh, I think I'm destroying both of them. So let's see. Groups. Yeah, I have 530 points. Angel has 420. And then Korra has 220. And he's done. He can't get any more points. Angel still has a chance to beat me. Uh, but it's just the three of us in that group. Mistra's loathing of such magic is well founded. It taints everything it touches. Not necessarily. Huh? Magic has no inherent morality. Its effect is entirely down to the inclinations of the wielder. Even Mistra herself abstains from passing judgment on those who use the weave. Her job is to ensure magic exists, not to dictate the purposes to which it is applied. There's no denying a certain perfume of decay hangs over such dark magic but that isn't to say it can't be put to good use or at the very least neutral use now i think it's time we moved on to lighter subjects for we too are lost to the darkness was there anything else dnl said uh-oh gail needs a makeover wow yeah, Gale has like two HP left. He's not doing well. He needs he needs some uh, beauty sleep for sure. Is Mister always such a demanding goddess? She expects those who seek to use the weave to do so honestly, and with respect for its potential to destroy, as well as its potential to save. I doubt she's asked many of her followers to blow themselves up. That's a fate she's bequeathed exclusively to me. She, she bequeathed it. Weren't our only means of survival. <laughs> However much she's annoyed at me. How are you feeling? It can't be easy facing the possibility of death. Oh, you know me. Never the optimist. I'm trying to focus on the positives. Truth is, I was living on borrowed time already. Consuming those items would only have kept the orb sated for so long. If anything, I feel more at peace than I have in months. At least now I know my death will have purpose. It won't be a distant bang in the footnotes of history. Moon said, Happy Easter. We're all doing well. Excited for summer. How are you doing? Summer? I just want it to be like spring. It's still, it's still just like cold and rainy. So... I'd love some nice spring weather before summer gets here, and then it's just, like, hot. Uncomfortable. I was wondering about that mighty lord you told me about in your story. Ah, oh, yes. Carsus. Carsus. Carsus was perhaps the most powerful wizard that ever lived. I thought you already said that Child about a different wizard that we just God, met. God, the elves called him. And he tried. With a spell of his own devising, he endeavored to usurp in one fell swoop the power of the goddess of magic. Mistril, she was called then. Imagine what it must have felt like to be a god, to know yourself, to be untouchable, to be mistaken. As Carsus aimed his spell at her, she began to unravel, and with her, the entire weave. Too late did he realize what he had unleashed. It would have been the end of everything had not Mistril sacrificed herself. The goddess of magic is all magic. By dying, the entire weave was lost, and the spell that challenged a god failed. It was the end of Mistral, the end of Carsus, and the end of an entire civilization. As the child who would be a god was turned to stone, his empire came crashing down around him. The floating cities of Netheril were no more, an event that came to be known as Carsus's folly. Totally sounds like a real story. Yeah, totally. 
You have to admire the man's ambition. He very nearly succeeded. If it takes the death of a god to stop you, I'd say your ambition has gotten somewhat out of hand. Not that I'm one to talk, of course. Now, so many centuries later, I try to follow in the footsteps of Carsus. Not to destroy Mistra, but to prove my love for her. I try to control only a fraction of the magic that was unleashed that fateful day. I merely sought to return one tiny diamond to an imperfect crown. Gale's folly, one might call it. History. Repetition. It's the way things go. All right. Well, you're going to need to stay here and I think about the things. Of that decision, but so be it. I'll be here in the meantime, idling away the hours. All right. So I want Shadowheart to join our party. This place. There's a power in these shadows. I can sense it. It's ancient. Familiar. Remember when you told me night orchids were your favorite flowers? Ring the bell? Why? It just so happens I have one right here. Oh, hells. You didn't pick that by hand, did you? They're deadly poisonous. Joking. They're safe. And beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> she got me. I was I like, oh my gosh, I'm going to die. I to give you in return, I'm afraid. I'm sure you'll come up with something in time. We'll see. Give me a while to put my imagination to work. Mm. Okay. Uh, you said before you want to become a drug justicier. What does that mean to you? Anyways, join me. All right. Some company wouldn't hurt on the road. Especially if there's trouble. Level up. All right, Latrice said, that's good and I know what you mean. I'm excited for summer too and I'm doing good too. Here sometimes it's hot and sometimes it's cold. Earlier it was cold, like the winter or something, but it did warm up a little. I just think the summer gets so hot, it's like not fun to go outside. Spring is perfect. All right, we're now a level six cleric. All right. So I think that's good. I guess. All's well that ends. No, not as bad as it could have. Might as well put some stuff away again in this chest. I have a lot of stuff that I can sell at some point here. Crossbow, Harper Blade. All right. Let's go to bed now. The voice of the Absolute is strong here. Ooh, my visitor's back. Stronger. I don't know how much longer I can resist it. But it's good to see you're making progress. You took an unexpected route here. You did a brave thing, saving those people in the grove. I did what I could, but I'm not sure they'll survive out there on their own. 
Don't be so hard on yourself. It's not your fault the world is wicked. You did the right thing. The hurt runs deeper than she's willing to show you. Are you all right? Yes. Yes, I am. Beneath the resilient veneer, a touch of fragility. She needs comfort. Hold her tight. Aw. I'm hugging my dream visitor. It's been a very long time since someone did that. For me. Uh, I hope you don't mind. Mind? <laughs> I'm grateful. It just doesn't stop. We are being bombarded by waves of telepathic energy. Wave after wave with hardly a breath between them. <sighs> I almost dare not rest. Each wave a set of orders to the infected. The order for your transformation has been given many times already. I just hope my powers last long enough to see this through. So she keeps protecting me from being transformed by these... Um... You know, worms in my head. Sleeping in the dark, Karlak is inspired. All right. Got a little auto save. Let's do a true save as well. And let's leave camp. The dark lady shields me. I can feel her. No time to rest. Leah, how's it going, Leah? Careful, I mind. A quick rummage. How was your visit, Leah? With pleasure. Quite the bonus there. Oil of accuracy, poison resistance, lightning resistance, and a lot of gold. Nice. Let's be quick. Oh wait, did I not loot this guy? Guess not. All right. North, last light in. South, Risen Road. West, Rythwind Town. <laughs> Begita's Diary. I don't think I saw this before. I need a rest. I'll make it, but if I don't... Let these words tell my story. The curse came, most ran, my Ron included, but I'd spent too long in the trenches of this town, building up what little I had to let it go. Took what I could in the barrow and followed. I was slower, but I made it, nearly. God's damn barrow broke, but I'm nearly out. Just need one last rest, a breath or two, and to tell my story. This is a key, small iron key. Seems like somehow the barrow got uh, turned into a tree. Absorbed up into the tree.
why won't you jump over here, bro? Ish. Night and shadow have claimed this place. Turn back. Moving in. There. Oh, here's the traveler's chest. Okay. We already read this last time, but I'll read it again there. Open up. Alright, I guess I can't go out that way, so... said it went really well it was a lot of fun but my dad does not look good at all i'm really concerned and i'm really worried about him oh man well i'm glad that it was good leah sorry to hear that uh he's not looking great though that's discouraging obviously all right let's save again here i feel like i have so many save files in this game Maddie said, I beat the next well, level in that game. One guilt. more level boss wave in the final <laughs> world. Waiting mode. What's going on here? You walk in the darkness unafraid. How curious. Kaka! <laughs> A fair point. Perhaps this one could assist us. The murdered lie silent. The raven asks, will you be their voice? Who murdered this woman? She is not the victim. Nay, she is the perpetrator. This woman tended a bar where she took her patrons, her friends, into her confidence. Promised their secrets were safe with her. Yet she turned their words into knives and stabbed them in the back. They died because of her. And to this day, her victims lie unavenged. I have no heart. I seek a record of this one's crimes, written in her own hand. Through it, I can summon her spirit and force her to face trial for her crimes. That's powerful Such magic. Such spells are ancient secrets and closely guarded. But I could be convinced to share them with an ally. Your soul sparks with justice, with fortitude. This is your chance to bring a murderer to justice. ...to avenge her victims. Will you take it? I will. What must I do? I thank you. As to those who died by her words. Go to the distillery. The one she calls the, the Waning Moon. The distillery. Moon. Find the ledger... ...and bring it to me. All right. Good conversation. Nice little chat we had here. Um, okay, let's go up here. And loot these dudes again. 
You know, it would be interesting. Do I have speak to the dead on any of these? What a day. I guess not. No time to dally. Turn undead. I don't think I have speak to the dead though. Wait, wait. Speak with the dead. The corpse has nothing to say. Oh, great. It had nothing to say. Let's try one more time. The corpse regards you lifelessly. What happened to you? The forest. No escape. The darkness turns all. Twists all. What were you doing here? Scouting. Seeking. Gaps in cultist defenses. Did you find a gap? Caravan to Moonroy's towers. Know how to keep the shadows at bay. Maddie said, okay, working on the final level for the second final world. Good luck, Maddie. We believe in you. How can I fend off these cursed shadows? Last light, uh, Isabel. Where did you come Last from? Last light in sanctuary from darkness. Stronghold. The spell's power wanes. I can ask no more questions. down okay so now we've completed this circuit Wait, how do we get out of this right, let's look at this map real quick So, where did I not go? I guess I didn't come over here. Okay, this is, yeah, this is where I need. Let's see what we have here. Some rags. Ooh, a nice little key. All right, we got a key. Don't know to what, but we got one. Must grab it. I guess I never got this. Camp supplies, okay.
raven. We'd better take a peek. What the heck? Is this a million ravens? Okay, I'm completely surrounded by ravens that are all trying to murder me. Oh my gosh, dude. She's completely surrounded by my ravens. Jeez. Bear attack by ravens. How are they? They're, they're attacking me with the power of bears, but they're ravens. Hmm. Okay, they only have one health each though. Thank goodness. All right, they're undead. Fight. The let's undead go. ravens. Right, let's do this. attack here let's examine this resistance to necrotic She died? Sheesh. Make it hurt. Well, so much for peace. Torment. My turn. You need a little help. Man, these crows really oh, did a way. number on me, man. Oh, I put the wind back in my sails. Sorry, they're ravens, not crows. Did any of these even have anything? Probably not. That's the thing about undead ravens, they don't have any loot on them. This letter's written on a scrap of paper. Blood and age have made it near illegible in parts. Help! A darkness has rolled into Wraithwin, cutting us off on all sides. We've sent people through, but no one can make it more than a few steps before. The words are obscured by drops of blood. This letter's our last hope. Send help. Anyone from anywhere. I beg of you. I'll renounce our lady loss and kiss the moon maiden's feet if that's what it takes. Just don't let the darkness take us. 
All right, so that was from maybe the actual raven. A lot of cursed ravens here, and they all got nothing. What's in here? We should save again. Maddie said, finally come to the last world. I hope things with game story next time. The signpost says this place is protected and full stomach must be the refuge no the harpers spoke of welcome to the last light in all right so we made it to the last light in i'm thinking we might as well go in here all right so this is the last light in where we've made it here Let's look at quest for a second, just for funsies. Keep your hands off your weapons. Easy. He's with me. Come. Jahira. The double swords. Okay, okay. She looks intense. So what you doing? Okay, you're trapping me. Um, Jahira, is it? I'm Crimson Moon, and I assure you, none of this is necessary. I'm magic incarnate. These vines will not hold me. Just this once, I wish people would simply say hello. I assure you, it is. Okay. Whoop. Didn't mean to press that. I saved your soldiers, and this is the thanks I get. Kindness is too often a decoy. Ooh. This is why we're here, you see. You got one of those little guys, huh? It's a curious creature that hides all manner of secrets. But if there's one thing that we know... It's that it knows its own kind. should never have come here, true soul. I am not a true soul. Stop! What are you doing? He's the one who saved us! He 
remember the these kids. Protected the Emerald Grove. Yep. Didn't leave a goblin standing. Not so bad to hang around with either. I pretty much trust him with my life. I pretty much trust him with the my life, but not that not that left eye though. How is that possible? The weave itself burns through my veins. Perhaps the tadpole is afraid. I've met no sorcerer that powerful. And I've met many. Now speak plain. How do you have control? I know it's hard to trust anyone right now, but believe me, I am not an absolute cultist. I gotta roll a 21 on a 20 sided die. All right, we, we would have to roll pretty high, but let's try. Just for funsies. Oh, uh, we got close. We got close, Crimson Knights. Could try again. This is an extremely tough roll. Oh, we might have gotten it. Let's see. We got it. Hey, we got it. All right, I'll take it. Congratulations. You've earned yourself the benefit of the doubt. Hear me, Harpers. All clear. At ease. I'll not pretend to understand why you, the enigma that you are, suddenly crossed our path. But I'm old and wise enough to recognize a sliver of hope when it crawls out of the dark. Tell me. Why have you come here? <sighs> to destroy the Absolute in its lair, Moonrise Towers. Then you found an ally in me. For that is precisely why I am here. There's food in the inn over there. Beds too if you require rest. Aloe oil in the cupboard, in case the vines gave you a rash. A rash? Settle in. Then come join me for a drink. You may just be the godsend we've been praying for. That's more like it. That's what I was trying to say, lady. We're knocking around here, right? Shouldn't hang around too long, though. Oh my god, soldier. That's Jahira. Look the at her Jahira. adamantine armor. It's awesome. She lives in the city, right? Don't you know the whole story? Years ago, I do, over but a century, why don't you tell me as if I don't know it? Save Baldur's Gate from Saravok, a ball sport trying to plunge the city into war. My mum used to tell us stories about them. The legends who protected the city from evil. She said Jahira was a powerful druid, adamant, tough. I've told myself those stories a thousand times since. I never thought I'd meet Jahira. She's a hero, and I was always some outer city kid. Can't believe she wants to talk to us about working together. <laughs> what a day! What a day! Seems like a good move. Good to see a friendly face. Burning through our oil, but Harper Elifer. I think it's staring out into the dark so much as doing something to my eyes. Jahira seems sure of you. I hope she's right. This barricade might keep the shadows out, but it won't help against what's already inside. Okay. There's more where that came from. Harper Dareg. If Jahira trusts you, I trust you. But I'll be damned if a bug brain doesn't creep me out. I don't. Who's this? Harper Antony? Never thought I'd see the day Jahira shows mercy to a true soul. Or whatever it is you are. Quartermaster Tally. Stock up while you can. I only hope I've brought enough to see us through. I'll take everything you got. Anything I could take your hands, I'll take off your hands at no cost to myself. <laughs> Let's do it. Boom. Needed a 10, rolled a 10, and then got 11 bonus. 
absolutely crushed it. Cheeky. But, since you're asking... What you got? What'd I get? Supply pack, okay. Alright, I'll take it. Didn't really need it that much, though. You're all right by me. Alright, let's see what you got, lady. 1600 gold, that's important. Alright, here's a red dye, so I'll, I'll take that. Always like to have that. Sage green dye. Ooh, white and scarlet dye. How much is this stuff? It's cheap. Purple dye. Pink and leaf green dye. Mellow fruit dye. Ocean dye. Orange dye. Bloody plum dye. Blue dye. Alright, I bought a bunch of dyes. Alright, we'll also take those. We'll take these. Evard's Black Tentacles. Scroll of Melth's Acid Arrow. Polymorph. That's like, really? Transform a creature into a harmless sheep. Stinking cloud. All right, let's 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 look at this stuff here. Looks like there could be some really nice, nice stuff here. Bark skin armor is rare medium armor. Breastplate medium armor. Chainmail heavy armor. Obsidian laced robe. Rare clothing. Now what do, what do I currently have here? Blood guzzler garb. When an enemy damages the wearer, the wearer gains wrath for one turn. Now this would be obsidian laced robe. On a successful saving throw against a foe's spell, deal four to five, four to seven fire damage to them. Grants resistance to fire damage. Shade Clinger armor is rare light armor. Splint armor is really strong heavy armor. The mighty cloth is rare clothing. You gain bull strength and increase your strength score by 2 to a maximum of 20. You cannot be pushed against your will and you have advantage on saving throws against being restrained. Here is UNT scale mail, rare medium armor, 15 armor class. Add your full dexterity modifier to your armor class. Additionally, this armor does not impose disadvantage on stealth ability checks. But what's he wearing? He's got spider silk, which is rare light armor. This would be medium armor, though. Here's Cloak of Protection. Armor class plus one, saving throw plus one. There's a lot of nice stuff here, huh? Shield of Devotion, a very rare shield. Cinder Snap Gloves, protection from missiles. Gloves of the Balanced Hands, two weapon fighting. When you make an attack with your offhand weapon, you can add your ability modifier to the damage of the attack. Metallic gloves. Amulet of the Harpers. Advantage on wisdom saving throws. Check. Whatever comes, I'm ready. Someone there. All right, we got a lot going on here, Crimson Knights. Let's see. Oops. Oh, 
I don't have enough. I don't even have enough gold for this. Jeez. Incandescent staff. All right, we got to sell like a lot of stuff. Um, okay. Take care now. I want a lot of this person's stuff, so here's what we're gonna have to do. We gotta go to camp. And pretty much here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take all this. We're just going to try to sell, like, all this stuff. Carrying capacity is exceeded, it says. So, now let's go over here. Okay, so there's all that stuff. there all right that's a lot of what I wanted to sell I guess so now let's leave camp again let's sell all this stuff If you're all right by Jahira, you're all right by me. We gotta do some of this inventory management, Crimson Knight. Sorry. It is what it is right now. this like incense stuff we're gonna sell all this I don't need any of these candles bundle of incense more candles here's a bottle grubby bottle sell that here's a malachite we can sell that a gate bloodstone
Rotten mushrooms. Rotten fish. Rotten tomato. Alright, so we sold all that stuff. Now let's go down here to the next bit of stuff. Sickle. All this leather armor. Got some whipping canes. Sell some of this stuff. Rags. Rags. Onyx. Malachite. Glass chalice. Bloodstones. Agates. Incense stick. Some ropes. Welcome back, Latrice. We're trying to sell stuff so we can buy stuff. So we did all that. Now let's see if we can buy some nice stuff here. Let's try to get this obsidian laced robe. All right. Let's see what she's got. She's got an adamantine scale armor, so she's good. What's she wearing? She's got chain shirt plus two medium armor. So this thing is level 15. Let's try to get the incandescent staff as well. Oh, I can't even get this though, man. It's 1463. She's got Jorgirl's Greatsword. Defender Great Axe. Making me sweat. When making your first attack of the round, you can reduce this weapon's enchantment by one to increase your armor class and saving throw bonus by one. I don't know. Um... I actually feel like the, the biggest thing I want is this staff. What's she running around with? A shattered flail. He's just got this dagger. See, he could have this rapier plus two. Where'd that just go? Hey, Jeremiah, how's it going, man? Man, I feel like I just sold so much stuff and still barely bought anything. 
All right, let's <laughs> let's go back again and see what else we can get to sell. Got some silver ingots and whatnot. Sell all that. It's a lot of like rotten stuff that I don't need. clothes we can sell all right I don't know how much this is gonna add up to but let's go sell it Jeremiah said, good. It's going to be 2026 before I tell you my sub night. Is your sub night going to be like if GTA right 6 or something team, like that? You're all right by me. It's going to be GTA 6. Dang, I'm still, like, not really that close to getting this, uh, incandescent staff that I want. What is this, 1463? Take care now. So we've got that. Now let's try putting red dye on this, maybe? So how do you how do you dye? Oh my gosh, I'm just wearing my undies. How do I put dye on something? Yeah, that didn't work. Get a dye remover. 
All right, so I made my I made my clothes red, so that's cool. Okay. Shadowheart is still carrying around this thing, this caravan strong box. Whatever that's worth. Jeremiah thinks it's going to be years before that game comes out. Might not be that long. Never a dull moment. Might, I mean, yeah, it's not going to quite be years. I mean, I think it'll be out. I think it'll be out by 2026. Alright, so anyway, I need more money, man. I need more money. Oh, her crossbow sucks, huh? Okay, and then she's got a flail and this studded shield, so she could actually use a better shield, huh? What kind of armor she got? She's got chain shirt plus two. Which is a 15 armor class. She's got a circlet. But no actual helmet. If you're all right by Jehovah, Maddie's saying, I'm still saying right 2025 is whatever everybody else is saying. I think 2025 could happen. End of 2025, like holiday 2025. I think, I think that could happen. I'm going to sell this scale mail. There's one over here too. Let's sell that. What are we at? We're at 1122. Sheesh. Take care now. Alright, I'm just working on, like, really getting my, my equipment in order, Crimson Knights. I'm sorry. Might be time to sort this. What can we sell? We can sell the trident. Probably can sell, you know, studded shield. I think we had better shields than that, though. Black and furnace red dye. Ooh.
So Morning Star. These are all just helmets. I think we'll sell a couple of these. Let's do Let's do this. Um Black and Furnace Red Dye. Let's put that there because I want to use that. Now I thought that there were more shields in here, but I'm not seeing them for some reason. What is this? The Grim Skull Helm. Attackers can't land critical hits on the wear. This is heavy armor, though. That's why I'm not wearing it, because I don't have anyone who's proficient in heavy armor. Here's the real Sparky Sparks Wall. Uncommon shield with a lightning aura. So this might be my best... My best shield there. And then did I have a long range weapon in here that she could use, she could equip? Not really, I thought that I had one, but maybe not. Someone's got to be holding on to one, right? Someone somewhere is carrying one. We just got to find who it is. All right, now let's try this. Black and red furnace die. So now it's black and red. I like her with the blue. Let's try him with uh, black and red. Let's try that. Interesting. I like put gold in it. Wits and blades always sharp. Trust no one. All right, let's try it. Let's try it with her. I am ready. Interesting. All right, let's move all of our dyes over. Here's a bunch of dyes. Here's some dyes. Here's some dye. Red dye, lavender dye.
What is this? A mace. Jeremiah said, I'm thinking maybe Rocket League or something else. For the sub night, I'm assuming you mean. All right, let's leave one more time, Crimson Knights. We're, we're doing a lot of inventory management. Thanks for bearing with me. Stock up while you can. I only hope I've brought enough to see us through. She's trying to get more free stuff. Boom. Critical success. Cheeky. But, since you're asking... What did we get that time? Another supply pack. If you're alright by Jahira, you're alright by me. All right, there's a little more stuff that we could sell. I'm trying to remember who was carrying it all. I think it's this stuff, right? Okay, Alright, I think that's looking pretty good, Crimson Knights. With haste. Got the new ancient sigil circle right there. Alright, after all that, we definitely need a save. Yes, we made it to the last light in DNL. So we just made it here. Hey, that's close enough. You ain't no Harper and you ain't no Fist. Don't need the likes of you crashing our party. Give it a rest, Alfred. We need all the God's damned help we can get. What party is it that I'm crashing? Rescue party. Not that you'll give a triple shot damn, but we were ambushed by their bloody cultists. Bastards torched the pigsty we were staying in and made off with the Grand Duke of Baldur's Gate himself. Oh, I remember that part. I was there in the aftermath. I don't suppose Counselor Florek made it all the way here. Sure did. For all the good that does us. She's inside. One of the ground floor chambers. Guess you need to be a God's damned counselor to get room and board around here. All right, guess they didn't like that. Oh, this is oh, this Anthony, is okay. Hope you know what you're doing, walking around with that thing behind your eye. TNL said, this is one of my favorite places in the game. True soul, I believe. How fortunate we are to have you among us. Jahira wants to know about supplies. The Harpers. Let's head inside. There's food and warmth to spare. Couldn't hang around too long, though. My gosh, Dark Maul the Wicked? Mm, what a vicious looking creature. I swear its eyes Pick are following shy? me. Have a gander at the finest stock. Ooh, ferocious looking beast. Although your stuffing might be leaking. 
All their natures it. failing. It could eat a person whole, or a double portion of children. I'm not. They all anybody. failed. Looking ahead. Premium trinkets and doodars. Cozy blue shirt. Here's Mattis. Welcome to our humble... Wait, are you Karlak? A lot of us were in Avernus. We saw you fighting. You were so good. Well, I, uh... Yeah, I guess I was. I mean, you should avoid fighting for devils if you can. But if you can't, it helps to have a good right hook. I saw you lay out a more demon in two hits. Bam! Bam! We were all like, whoa! <laughs> How'd you learn to fight like that? <laughs> Had to. Life didn't pull any punches. It was up to me to learn to take a hit and deal one back. I've been tossed around a lot, too. Uh, I want to learn how to fight back, too. From the look of things, you've got your wits about you. A clever mind and a bit of style will take you a long way. Fight with those, and you may find you never need to use your fists at all. In that case, want to buy a lucky ring I found? Ha! Ah, nice try, Shorty. A lucky Keep ring. Keep it up, though, and you'll be scamming with the greats in no time. Scamming with the greats? What kind of advice is that? Sorry, soldier, but I didn't ask for your two coppers. The advice I give a teeth kid from the coast is between me and them. Last light. Check it out. We've gone legitimate, and Mol put me in charge. What do you need? You got any stock for an extra special special customer like me? Hmm. I'm not supposed to mention it to anyone, but I do have something pretty special in stock. A key. What does it look like? What does it open? What treasures await behind its lock? That's for one lucky buyer to find out. Maul gave it to me and said I shouldn't let it go to just any old jack a day. If it was worth any coin, do you think Maul would have given it to you? Maul said I could have it. I'm about to teach this girl a lesson. You want to be scamming? You about to get scammed. Oh, she didn't. Oh, yeah, she did. <laughs> yes, she did. Yeah, huh? Really? But she said... <sighs> All right. Here. I guess. Tower shaped key. Nice. Stop. We took it. <laughs> uh, what can I get you? All right. Let me see what you have. What she got? Cloak of cunning broom. When the wear disengages, they also create a foggy cloud with two meters radius that lasts for a turn. Evasive shoes. Acrobatics and armor class plus one. She got, she got swindled and hornswaggled by a master. Spoon of saltiness. She sure did, DNL. They're trying to talk about swindling and whatnot. Well, I showed them how it's done. I don't think I really want anything she has, though. Pleasure TBH. Doing business with you. Yeah, I didn't do any business Premium with you. Trinkets. In the market for something special? I'm alive, ain't I? What's not to like? Very well. Don't wonder. Thought far. you'd be ten yards tall the way Zevlor spoke of you. Ceres, Scout. Seems we missed one another at the Grove, but the others told me how you helped us. A pity. You pulled them from one death trap only for me to land them in this one. 
What happened? Where's Zevlor? Gone. And more than half the others with him. We were ambushed out in the cursed lands. Cultists of this absolute. Zevlor froze, begged us to surrender. But they were toying with us, making examples. And we'd had enough of taking it. Those of us who cut free just kept running till we found this place. The others, maybe the cult got them. Maybe the curse. Have hope. You survived. I'm sure the others did too. Zevlor had hope. It didn't save him. A little sense will serve us better, I think. But... Thanks. It was sweet of you to try. That is an ugly cat right there. His majesty. Yeah, kitty kitty. Oh, we failed. We failed his majesty. Let's try again. There we go. Got it this time. Still ugly, though. You are ugly. Who's a good kitty? Not that cat. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stock. Here's Chihira. Please, be welcome. Have a drink. To your very good health. Thank you. Medicine. Smell the wine first. You perceive a faint hint of cloth grass. A herb that is said to elicit the truth. Jahira smiles at you knowingly. It doesn't spoil the taste, if that's what you're wondering. Hmm, what should I do here? No, but it spoils my trust. Indulge me. DNL said, LOL, his majesty so great. What a perfect example of Larian's animal characters. Maddie said, I think that's a good spot to stop tonight. I'm at level nine. All right, I guess, uh, fine. I'll drink the wine. Bottoms up. Shadowheart and Asterion disapprove. Well over a century old, and yet it hasn't lost a hint of flavor. Still not quite so sure about you, though. People tend to lose more than just flavor when illithids get their hands on them. I speak from experience. There's an air about you. Something alien. Answer me true and do not lie. The parasite is changing you, isn't it? Yes, the parasite's giving me powers I never had before. It's changing me for the better. Suppress the truth tr compelling drug with your innate magic, Lidor. Look around you. Good men, good women. Stranded here, two feet in the grave. If we're to survive, I have no choice but to trust you. Can I? Pain. 
You can trust me. Good. Because I'll cross your heart myself if you break it. I have every reason to be cautious. I've traced people like you. People with parasites in their brains. All the way here from Baldur's Gate. The cult of the Absolute is spreading through the city. Quietly, quickly, and with unsettling deliberation. We tracked them to this ancient village, only to be faced with a man we killed and buried over a century ago. Who was or is he? General Ketherick Thorm. Ketherick Thorm. Remember that name. He's the leader of the Absolutists. Okay. He was a Sharan once. Took to building an army of dark justiciers beneath this very village. Alongside the local druids, we made it our business to see him deposed, dead and buried. But he's returned. Not only does General Ketherick Thorm live again, it seems he is no longer mortal. He has become, in fact, invincible. We met him on the road here, commanding an army of the Absolute intent on destroying Baldur's Gate. I put an arrow through his eye myself, only to watch him pluck it out like a splinter. He healed right in front of me and chased us into the shadows. Things looked hopeless. But experience has taught me that no matter how bleak things look, there's always hope. You are that hope. Darn right I am. All right, Jeremiah, have a good night, man. Thanks for hanging out. Again, I'll probably be back streaming again tomorrow with most likely some more Baldur's Gate. What do you have in mind? Invincibility? That's powerful magic. Thankfully, I have my own. And the wit to know when it will not avail you, I think. We must try another way. Protected by your artifact, you can infiltrate his forces at Moonrise Towers, posing as a true soul. Find out what it is that makes him invincible, so we can strip him of his advantage. Once Gatherick is without his shield, the sword, Together, we assault his tower and put a final end to this blight. His days are numbered. I'll make sure of it. Without a cure for your infection, your days are numbered too. Yet you selflessly offer to spend them fighting alongside us. I like you. I promise I will do everything I can to make sure you survive this. Perfect. That's a good Any deal. I'll take that deal. Understanding the disease. Whatever magic Gatherick's using to control these tadpoles, it must be at moonrise. Until then, we keep drinking wine when we meet. How do I reach him? The towers are surrounded by shadows. You're not our only secret weapon. Isabel, a faithful cleric of Seluna, and a light in the darkness. She cast the moon shield around the inn. It's the only reason we're still alive. She's upstairs in her chambers. Tell her I sent you, and she'll see you through the shadows safely. Perfect, perfect. All right. All right, Crimson Knights, like Maddie said, I think this is a good spot to stop tonight for her and for me. It's getting late. Um, made some good progress. We found our way through this, uh, this battlefield, found the light in or whatever it's called, and making our way through act two. So the, the story seems to be, you know, progressing, accelerating a bit. And we're having a good time. So thank you guys so much for joining the stream. Thanks for liking the video. Being subscribed, join, followed on the channel, whether you are on YouTube or over on Twitch. Have a good Friday tomorrow. And uh, I will most likely see you on Friday night. Till then, Crimson Knights. Have a good one.